Our story begins in the year 923 of the Fourth Age in the beautiful kingdom of Arendal. During a peaceful spring night, King Darvig witnessed the birth of his long-awaited heir. But to his surprise, he received not one, but two boys, Emmerich and Radko. As the brothers grew older, the kingdom expanded and prospered. People lived in peace and enjoyed domestic felicity under their proud king. Yet it all changed when the boys turned 20 years of age. The king became ill, and days after, he expressed his last wish. Love one another, and do what is best for Arundel. For I leave the crown to both of you. The brothers, however, were not like their father. They didn't agree on much, and neither thought of sharing the crown. On the day of their father's death, they split apart and gathered their own lords and men in hopes of swaying the people to one side. Despite their efforts, the kingdom was very much divided, just like the young nobles. In the coming years, a civil war erupted and Arundel suffered greatly. With a constant stalemate, the brothers met once again, perhaps for the last time. This was the fated duel in which the victor would be crowned the King of Arundel. wanted to come to this dear brother not in 1000 years did i think we would face one to one in battle then you should have let me have the crown and expand what our father started your pride would have ruined exactly what our father wanted us to build upon your blind eyes will never see what i had envisioned but perhaps you'll open them in the afterlife so be it Love one another and do what is best for Arundel. Radko. Emmerich. Without you by my side, brother, there is no Arundel. There is only half. You were right. I am blind to it all. Forget the animosity and our differences. The one thing I know for sure is that our father would not have wanted one of us to die by the hand of another. Let's carry the legacy together as friends, not enemies, and make him proud. And so the story of Arendal continued, with the leadership of not one, but two great kings. Over the years they ruled far and wide, made peace with friends, and defended the kingdom from foes, just as King Darvig dreamed on that spring day many, many moons ago. <laughs> <laughs>